Hello, my fellow Dirt Road Travelers. We are on our way right now to King of the Hammers. Come along with us. It's going to be an epic time. All right, guys. So if you have not been out to King of the Hammers, you guys are missing out. It is an endurance race that also involves rock climbing. These vehicles are put to the test along with their drivers. It is an amazing event to see, right, Nate? Absolutely, it's a really good time. Oh yeah, and they also have it all set up. There's vendors out there, people camp usually for the weekend. It goes on for almost two weeks. It's like a week and a half. And it is just an amazing blast, an awesome time. Let us show you around and show you what King and the Hammers is all about. Right, guys when you first get into Hammertown it can be kind of crazy and a little bit of nuts there's gonna be a lot of cars and a lot of motorcycles and bikes and quads whatever you want to name it's gonna be running up and down the dirt road so just keep your eyes open and your patience have a good amount of patience <laughs> all right guys so let's get in there and let's try to find where we're camping at and then we'll take you around all right guys we've currently made it to the campground right now we are currently camping with Feeney, Danny, Oscar, George from Trail Militia. It is going to be an awesome day. I also forgot Dave from Weston. He is also here. So this is going to be freaking awesome. Alright, good morning my fellow dirt road travelers. It is the next morning. It was just so overcast and there was just so much dirt in the air. We didn't get much footage, but I did get some footage at night at Chocolate Thunder. Kind of parent warning, I'm going to try to bleep out as many bad words as I possibly can, but it was pretty intense. Let me show you right now. Guys, you probably can't even see us, but Penny and I are down here at Chocolate Thunder right now. We're watching all the spectators at night. It's, it's intense. freaking crazy. There was almost a fight. Everybody's crashing into each other. It is crazy down here at Chocolate Thunder.
it's so real out here. This guy's rolled. That guy's trying to get by. Now he's healthy. We got like three or four more weeks trying to get through. Give us a little breakdown, dude. What's going on right now? Oh, he's dry. He he ain't got nothing in it. It leaked all over the place. You right. It's going to run. That's going to run. Toyota is wild, yo. <laughs> Pretty freaking crazy, right? Chocolate Thunder is nuts at night. It is a complete party. There's fireworks and everyone is full sending it. It was an amazing and time to see it right now we're gonna go take you guys down to go see the vendors and go see what everybody is about it should be pretty freaking awesome let's go check it out all right guys so we just got here to the vendor area we're gonna go check it out Out the size of this axle, it's ridiculous. So it's a two piece shaft, it's the biggest RCB I've ever seen. Oh, that's all right. All right, guys, so we just came up on George's Bronco, George from Pro Militia. He's over here at the Super Wedge and Weston booth. What is that in your window, George? Is that a light bright poster? I am so jealous right now. Wesson and Super Wench is definitely rolling in deep. They've got a lot of vehicles at this event. All right, guys. What do you think? F100? Fully built, pretty sweet, or giant off-road camper? Life's full of tough choices, huh? All right, guys, that was Hammertown. It is an awesome place to go check out. You just have to make sure that you pay to get in the gate and you have your wristband to get in. There's tons of vendors, some little freebies. Uh, I was able to pick up some jerky, the Baja jerky. That's freaking delicious. You guys gotta stop and try that one. Um, right now, we're gonna be on our way. We're gonna go see if we can catch some of the race right now. <laughs>
right guys let me show you this crazy crazy site these are all rvs trailers motorhomes everybody is parked out here in the desert at the end of this race all this is going to clear out these are all just temporary lodgings check this out As far as the eye can see, there are thousands and thousands of people out here for this event. It is just freaking crazy. All right, guys, it was super hard to get footage of the races. They were just really spread out today. We will be back again, and we'll get more footage out before another video. Right now, we're gonna go play on the sand dunes right now. behind us the sun is setting and that is coming to a close on this weekend of king of the hammers but guess what there's one more weekend coming up there'll be another video next week nate i had an amazing time did you oh yeah it's amazing king of the hammers is just an experience if you guys haven't been here you need to come check it out oh definite so that's it for this episode we're hungry tired and dirty and that's the end of this dirt road journey bye guys, bye, guys.